sun doesn't shine on the same dog every day. <laughs> so when it's shining on yours, it's safe. That tail is, woo, he's running. He's running, he's running. Let's give this egg sucking leech thing a try. Hey, how's it going? It's Outdoor Vector here, and I finally finished assembling our day four video of our trip to Alaska. During the fourth day of our trip, we met up with some guides to drift the Upper Kenai River and the Kenai National Wildlife Refuge. It's some really beautiful country with amazing views and fishing. And just as we were about to launch our boats, we saw a friend from afar. We parked our cars at Jim's Landing and then drove with them up the road to Sportsman's Landing. And that's where we started our drift down the Kenai. We've got rods. He's got a, the setup he's got right now is an indicator about 12 feet down to a, basically a bead and a hook. Bead's about two inches above the hook. Hey, hold up, hold up. All right. You guys have to wear these in the boat. Okay. 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 Uh, when you get out and wading and stuff, you don't need them. If you fall down, yeah. Stand up, and I'll throw them. <laughs> you guys ready? Yeah. yeah let's Just push the boat out, guys. And okay. Turn to get in the back here. That's good. Okay. <laughs> Since we had six guys with us, we actually took two boats and two guides with three guys in each boat. Our guide was pretty knowledgeable and actually a bit salty, but he actually ended up being pretty funny uh, and also taught us a lot about being on the river and what, how to fish the river. I started the day off getting pretty tangled up while we peppered him with all sorts of questions. Yeah, that's even almost too much. How much drag? Is it already set to good drag or? I don't know. I have no Maybe. idea. We'll find out. Yeah. Is it going to be a light tape or? How about you'll know? Okay. Start high, long leader, you know, roll so it out. Yeah, it's yeah. long leader. Long leader, yeah. Okay. That's why you have to always stand there. And what's really sad, there's about 2,000 dollies and char right in front of the boat. <laughs> and they haven't turned on yet. Good one. You got a bite. Yeah, that was a bite. Oh, yeah? I think so. There, bud. Yeah. Nice rainbow. We did both drift yeah. fishing and also we waded out into the Kenai River in certain stretches and certain holes that the guide knew of. Hey John. Uh, He's still there. He'll run towards me. I couldn't like Yeah, you got a real faster strip strip. Ben and Dave both had some fish on early. Uh, it took me a while to get started. I had a few fish on, but I there lost them. There you go, them. nice. But I finally got hooked into some good fish. 
All right, fish on, finally. Be sure to check out my full length video of this yeah, rainbow trout that I caught. Yeah, he's, he's this fighting. This was the so. biggest fight that I have ever had with a fish, and it for sure was the biggest rainbow trout that I have yeah, ever Yeah, he's caught. in the deep right on the edge. Yeah, he's right on the edge. You gotta, you gotta try to lead him out of the deep. It was both an exhilarating and quite nerve wracking nice. fight that I had. I'll put a link up to the video up above. Oh so that shoot, you can this check guy is pulling big. Come on. Dude, big. Oh. Oh man. Walk, here, walk back a couple more steps. That tail is. Woo! Yeah, bring, bring he's it. Running. He's running, he's running. Holy nice. Holy smokes. Dude, that was huge, man. He's tired. Maybe he's tired. Nope. Oh, 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 oh. Flip him this way. Come. Hey, this guy, let's get him in the net, guys. Huh? Let's, let's put him in the net. net, yeah. Let's put him in the net. I want to put him in the net. You running? I spooked him. Dude, this guy is a beast. <laughs> he is around. huge. He's barely gonna fit this net, man. <laughs> Show us how. Yeah, it's huge. I saw the broad side of it, and I was like, yeah, that's gigantic. <laughs> there he goes. <laughs> He's huge, man. It's heavy. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> oh, yeah! Oh, yeah! My <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> Dude, yeah! <laughs> Hand on his tail, one hand under his belly. And keep the net under the fish in case he drops it, okay? Enormous. Good. Oh, dude. All the frustration. Oh, yeah, baby. There's a sockeye salmon right here. He's on his way to dying. Looks like. He finished spawning and he's on the way to this part of his life. Here along the side of the banks, you can see that all the dead salmon that basically, you know, they swim up river, they spawn and then they die. So here you can see them peppered along the bank. Fish on. Ah, oh, came off. <laughs> yeah. Right. That's a nice fish. That's a nice fish. I didn't think it was so big, but it's a nice fish. <laughs> Sun doesn't shine on the same dog every day. <laughs> so when it's shining on yours, I take it. Yes, I'll take it. <laughs> nice dog. Nice. That's a dolly varden? Mm -hmm. Never... Awesome. <laughs> oh, a little too rough. 
Too rough. That's why I was looking over there. I thought you had one on. I, I felt something and then the fish jumped. I don't know if it was like... Oh, that's a good one. All right. Big jump there. There's a good one. Back up, back up. Real. Yep. Oh. You up there? Look. Yeah. Dang it. <laughs> this is all part of the Kenai Wildlife Refuge. Need a special permit to fish this area, I believe, which our guide has. All right, Dave is on. Dave is on. Oh. There you go. <laughs> That's a quick release. <laughs> Carl? Oh yeah, there you go. Down here, get down below here. Woo. Either down below or up above, one or the other. Yeah. Yeah. You got him, you got him. You on? All right. Is it a big one? <laughs> All I know is I'm tired. Shoot. <laughs> oh my. Lost a lot of ground by them. Try going in a different direction. <laughs> there you go. There you go. It's a jumper. It's a good one. Pull back, pull it. Yeah, I'll tell you when. All right.
Nice one. I really do recommend taking a trip down the Upper Kenai if you get the chance. The fishing was awesome for everybody. But it's not just the fishing that was awesome, it's also just the breathtaking and awe-inspiring environment that you're in. Well, until next time, have a great time outdoors.